Alright guys, Mr. Bennett again and this is a past paper 2013 to be exact and it's a solve matrices form 214 RS plus until that is a T I'm gonna write it better almost full is a T and we are supposed to find all four of these letters now this means it is multiplied, right? So remember, it's row by column. So let's go. So 2 times R would be 2R. 1 plus T would be T. And then now, 2 times S is 2S. 1 times U would be U. 4 times R is 4R. And 3 times T would be 3T. Now 4 times S, 4S. Plus 3 times U, 3U. Now we are supposed to equate this to the corresponding one. So it's 2, 1, 4, negative 1. So 2, this must go to this. This must go to this. Alright. So let's write it back. 2R plus T is equal to 2. And 4R plus 3T is equal to 4. As you can see, guys, it's a simultaneous equation, right? Two unknowns. Alright, if you know 2s plus u, 4s plus 3u, this is equal to 1 and this is equal to u. All we have to do is solve them separate. Alright, we can multiply this by, we'll go by 3 and by 1, because 1, the coefficient will be the same. So we'll get rid of t, right? But remember, if we multiply everything. 3 times 6, 6R. Six Guys, this is on the channel already, so we don't have to fussy about it, alright? 1 times this will give us 4R plus 3T is equal to 4, because 1 times anything is anything. Now we want to get rid of T. We have plus T and plus T, so we can minus. What we have to do is with the entire equation. So this would give us 2R is equal to 2, therefore r is equal to 1. What we can do now is substitute r equal 1, let us eat over here, r equal 1 in equation, let us do this one, 6r plus 3t, 6r plus 3t, doesn't matter which you use guys, is equal to 6. We know r is 1, so we're going to replace it with 1. Because this is the value of 1, right? Alright. So plus 3t equals to 6. 616 of a 3t. Subtract 6 from both sides. Guys, the reason I'm going so fast. This is already this is already on the channel, alright? So r is 1. So 6 ones. What was the equation again? Oh Lord, I use the wrong equation. It's actually 2R. 2R, so it's 2R plus T is equal to 1. Could I use that one, do you know, guys? Alright, so R1. Let me choose 2 ones, 2. Oh, this was 2. Can I read it up again? T. So t is equal to 2 minus 2, so t is equal to 0. Alright, let us solve this one. So r is 1, t is 0. Let us do this one now. Right, we are going to multiply by? Which one we want to get rid of? We can get rid of the s. So multiply this, we can get by 2 and this by 1. We just want to get the unit to be the same. 2 times 4 is 4, 1 times 4. Alright? So remember, everything I multiply by 2 for the top one. So 2 times s, 2s would be 4s, 2 times u would be 2u, and 2 times 1 would be 2. 1 times anything will give you anything, so let's go. Alright, we have to subtract 4s, we have 2 positive, so we can subtract, right? That gone, this will give us negative u, our subtract right here. So therefore, we get a positive. So this is 3. So therefore, u is equal to negative 3. 
So now that we know that u is negative 3, we can substitute substitute u equal minus 3. We show the equation. We protect this. 2s plus u is equal to 1. We know that u is negative 3. So anywhere we see u, we're going to put negative 3. So therefore, 2s. Get rid of this negative 3 right here, which is a plus 3. So what we do to one side, we do to both sides. So we end up with 3 plus 1, 4. And then we divide by 2. That's 2 times at the inverse. So s is equal to 2. So here's your answer. Let us just put all the answers in one place. So r is equal to 1. u is equal to minus 3. s is equal to 2 and t is equal to zero. All right, guys, thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video, all right? Guys, what we can do, you know, is we can put those values in the equation and see if it uh, it works out. Let me just show you how you test it. All right, guys, as I said, let us test it to see if it is correct. So we're gonna replace the values. So we have two, one, four, three, we get it r to be 1, so we'll put 1 there, so s is 2, so we'll put 2, u is negative 3, and t is 0, when we don't multiply, we're supposed to get this, so let us go, row by column, 2 times 1, 2, 1 plus, 1 times 0 is 0, 2 times 2 is 4, 1 times 3 is minus 3, 4 times 1 is 4, 3 times 0 is 0, 4 times 2 is 8, 3 times that is negative 9. Let us compute now. 2 plus 0 is 2, 4 minus 3 is 1, 4 plus that is 4, and 8 minus 9 would be negative 1. Let us compare. 2, 1, 4, negative 1. So there you have it, guys. It is indeed correct. See you guys in the next video. Remember guys to share so other people can get help. I'm out.